I'm losing my mind here, man. I, I, I told you I suck at Tainted Judas. I try to use Dark Arts and it just goes horribly. I don't know why, man. Something about this item like just doesn't click with me. Dark Arts just does I need to use this Empress card, man. My DPS is so dog shit. I can't, I can't do this anymore, man. I need to be able to at least like kill enemies, brother. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. What do you mean that does a full heart of damage? Are you serious? Playing Dark Judas today because I have realized I haven't played this guy in a while and also... Okay, that was on me. I thought I still had, I had Dark Arts for some reason. And because I suck as this character because I try to use Dark Arts and I use it horrendously poorly. Um... I like I like something about this item just short circuits my brain when I try to use it I just can never use it correctly. I think I should just play this character as if dark arts didn't exist I shouldn't use it in com combat ways unless it is defensively I the problem with dark arts is I think I've, I think I've like realized why I hate playing Okay, that's on me. Why I hate playing Stainer Judas is because I See that my DPS is not crazy because my brain's been fried from having too many crazy runs over the years to the point where I'm like, oh, I need to deal more damage. So I use Dark Arts offensively to try and deal more damage. And it always gets me hurt. It always fucks me up. Every single time. Okay, well, at least I got a nice tears up here. That's gonna help a ton. Thank you all very much. I appreciate that. I've already gotten hit twice on the first floor, but you know. It's the little things in life, really. Like, I had no reason to use Dark Arts there, but it just felt right, you know? It just felt right. Suplex is basically just Dark Arts with a different coat of paint. <laughs> If you think about it. Oh, I want that. I want that. I want that. I want that. Uh, can I get it somehow? Mm. Secret room down here. I would really like to not blow up my donut machine for it if I don't have to. Uh, I would hate to. I would hate to blow up my donut machine for it, matter of fact. Oh, fuck you. I can't hit this guy. What the hell, man? They can't even dark arts or suplex him. Like, I gotta just shoot him? Are you kidding me? Oh, you, I can't get that. I want, I want it. What the hell, man? I am deeply sorry for my actions, but also I have no options. They simply gave me no other choices. I had to do what I had to do. You think the secret room is right here? Uh, probably isn't. I can't, I can't get in because I don't have a bomb. Surely, uh, surely I will stop being trash at the game at some point. Curse of the Labyrinth, huh? Anyway, hi, how's it going? Hope you're doing good. Hope you're having an okay time. Hope life's treating you alright and all that. I don't see dark arts me. Part of it is also that's on the fucking Q button, and Q is hard to press for me because I also have to move, you know? Sometimes I gotta strafe left, and then I can't really actually up, and then I gotta, like, press Q. It's a bit fucked, man. It's a bit messed up, okay? I'm not looking for excuses. I'm not looking for excuses. Hollowed ground? Oh, that onion rules. What the fuck? I mean, it's a massive range down, and my range is already bad. But, uh, <laughs> but... It rules. It's a very good item, and once I get the range problem solved, we're all good, man. That was an amazing suplex play. Holy shit. Suplex is lovingly carrying this run right now. I love it. It just takes out those enemies at the perfect range. I love it. I love being able to, like, nuke every room. Oh, I found a secret room, too. Nice. Like, I can do it again here. I can grab this guy and just nuke the entire room like that. And I'm basically invincible the entire time. That's crazy. Am I gaining some newfound appreciation for suplex? That's that's absurd. <laughs> you look at that. All right, time to fight the boss, which you can, by the way, suplex as well. I didn't press Q in time. I guess I was like slightly too late or something. Suplex this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Fuck you, Min Min. Get dark arts and shit. Maybe I'm maybe I'm in the groove now. We're like getting a as many iframes as possible. <laughs> I still got hit, mind you, but you know. That's besides the point, and we go right away. Grab, grab blub. Okay, I fucked up the suplex play because the fucking this this is the worst blub arena ever conceived by anybody. It sucks, fucking anus. It's so bad. I got myself cornered. That that is just horrible. How did I end up there? I don't know where I am. I, I lost track of myself. World's world's most insane dark arts user. I'm gonna die, brother. <laughs> Die, please. Die, please. Okay, 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 we're good, we're good. I almost died in the blood fight, but we're good. And the game keeps bailing me out by giving me a little bit of HP to keep me alive. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Ooh, I like keeping it dangerous, huh? You know what? I gotta blow up these blue fires. Maybe they'll have something for me. Yeah, I doubted it, to be fair. You know what really helped uh, in this in this like fight and stuff? If I had, like, range... I had any oh thank you <laughs> i had any form of range that would have been really helpful thank you for hearing my prayers game and uh doing that for me there's my other item room by the way which i will lovingly 
take a look at. What do you got? Bursting Shack, huh? I'll be honest. <laughs> it's tempting. Because <laughs> I will end up taking a lot of damage from spiders. But I think a massive old tears up is good. And I've got both onions now. Ain't that something? I got both the sad and the dead onion. Which one came first? Well, probably the sad one. And then it became dead. Which is unfortunate, really. You know what I'm pleasantly surprised by for once? For once, both item rooms on a an XL alt path floor actually had items in them. This has been happening to me quite a lot. Uh, whenever I get an alt path XL floor, one of the item rooms just doesn't have items in it. it. Just has a bunch of cards and some trinkets or something like that, and I always feel like I've been absolutely, like, ripped off. And I always think, why would Edmund do this to me? He's doing this to slight me personally. I got crazy AoE. I got piercing shots. I got shooters in every corner. I also wanted some initiative, so I blew up their whole quadrant. Oh my god, that almost got me. <laughs> Fuck you, Min Min. Die. They got marbles, huh? Hmm. I like the idea of extra bombs, but... Kane's eye is kind of good. I don't know, I could just buy compass. I think I was on this floor, right? I'll probably just do that instead. Love me a finally, like, an actual damage upgrade. Don't look at me with that eye. <laughs> what the hell, man? Why, where did Judas's other eye go? It's just gone now. Can't have shit in Detroit. They, they took my man's eye. When suplex works, like, it... It fucking works, man. Like, it does the work. It just, like, when you, can, when you can just clear a whole damn room in one go, that's amazing. Because you have iframes for the entire duration, man. You can instantly kill an enemy you don't like. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's where I should dark arts to just get out, of, get out of position. What about my shop? I don't have that much money, but some trinket space wouldn't be too uh, underappreciated. Hey, hey, thank you for making this possible. That is an incredible trinket. Oh my goodness gracious. I love it. Puberty. Yeah, that's fine. Little Dumpy's pretty good. Gallo would have been cool as well, but unfortunately, I guess I gotta not have my son today. I shall have to live without him. Unfortunate, really. I need something, man. Just, I, I appreciate the keys, man. The full card. Uh, lovely. It's hoping for like a Hierophant or something. Like, I'm just not doing that hard on HP, you know? I've been doing a poor job trying to, trying to stay alive <laughs> right now. <laughs> All right, who are we fighting? Let me guess, it's Gideon? Yeah, all right. We meet again, brother. <laughs> I gotta do this shit without getting hit, because I <laughs> don't have the health for it. I, I could really use some range against fuckers like this, man. Iframes help as well, though. I just gotta be careful. I gotta be methodical. I gotta be dialed in, which is the hardest part about this, by far. Those iframes from Suplex are saving my ass right now, dude. They are saving me so hard. Oh, you can pick up those? That's cool, okay. I didn't know you could- Ah, fuck you. Those remained. Suplex. Huge, I killed like some- I got stuck on a hole? Um, Please, it's just one fly. It's just this one fly. I'm terrified. I am so fucking terrified. Please just die. HP, an angel deal. We are so back. I'll take this. I, suplex has served me super well, but I need HP right now. I'll I'll use Suplex for this fight, though, because fuck this guy. I didn't know that I can't blow up the fires. So that's curious. Book of Revelations is my way out. I will stay alive. I will persevere. I will live. I will become him. I, I will... I will live. Just keep throwing him into the fucking fire, bro. Just keep throwing him into the damn flames. Is Gabriel an Archangel? Genuine biblical question here. Gabriel is, a, is an angel, I know that. That's why we're fighting him, right? But is he like an Archangel or is he just a random angel? <laughs> that has happens to have like an important name or something. Okay, we are above the hump. I just gotta stay a fucking like alive now and <laughs> I will be good. Let me have the keys up here. That's another charge, that's another heart. And I'm gonna Dark Arts my way over. Okay, I, I, I didn't trust myself. What? Huh? What do you mean? I'm gonna full card out of here. I didn't step on any spikes. What the fuck was that? It must have been like a fucking like one frame type bullshit, man. What the hell? Oh, uh, well, at least I went to pick up the key so I could... Yay. Is there a soul heart for sale in here? No. Okay, I guess a charge is effectively a soul heart. I will live. I have been told to live. I have been given the order. So I shall stay alive. That is my goal. I, it's a hard thing to do as Tana Judas for me to stay alive sometimes. I I am mad that that hit me. Also, I forget that these bones do full hearts of damage for some reason. Item room, straight away. I got pay to win. I got I got a dream, basically. Spelunker hat is pretty damn good already. 
Can I reroll that in good conscience? Nah. I can't. I simply can't. Does it have anything worthwhile? Well, it has access to my challenge room, which in a way is worthwhile. It's a range up, which I could actually really use right now. So I'm happy to have that. My range is finally above the level that I started at. Matter of fact, it's like finally at like a normal level that a normal character would be at. Hello, Singe, you foul creature. Let me use those rocks to get a little bit of extra damage, huh? you never seen me do that one before, have you? You ever seen a motherfucker utilize your tools against you, huh? Yeah, okay, go, go jump, motherfucker, see if I care. You just put another rock on the field, which is an extra damage bonus for me. Piece of shit. I don't know why I have such, like, an adversarial hate for Singe. <laughs> like, he's just a little freak, he's nothing special, you know? I don't know why I hate him so much. <laughs> he doesn't deserve all this hatred, he's a little freak, but that's about it, man. We chillin', right? We chillin'. But it feels so good to be a hater sometimes, man. Thank you, Lil Dumpy, for being a friend. You have saved me uncountable amounts of times already from taking damage that I absolutely would have assuredly taken. <laughs> so, I can't really be upset about everything he's done for me. What do you got for me, Greed? That's actually fine, man. I need cash anyway to play restock machines on future floors, so... Thank you, Lil Dumpy, once more! <laughs> oh boy, money uh, savings as well, thanks to Steam Sale. That's another full little bit of HP here. Do I want Devil's Crown? Do Devil's Crown and Pay to Win work together? Like, if I go into an item room with Devil's Crown, will it have the restock machine from Pay to Win in it? I guess it's worth trying, right? I'll give it a, I'll give it a shot. We'll see how it works. Because uh, if that works, then that is actually like an incredible combo. Because I can like just reroll Devil Deals at Infinitum. I would ra rather not actually take items from them until I've gotten my second key piece. But you know, you can't. Beggars can't be choosers. Like you gotta, you gotta make do with what you got. Yeah, that was just bad damage to take. Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking. All right, clutch. Oh, my arch, my actual arch nemesis. Dark Arts has been pretty valuable for this fight. Uh, uh, surprisingly. I will admit, I will admit, it has done surprisingly good work for me. Lil Dumpy has also been indispensable <laughs> this run so far, man. He has saved me from so many hits I would have taken otherwise. That was the first time I got hit this fight, which is honestly quite uh, impressive for me. That's an impressive showing for a clutch fight, I'll be honest. I don't usually do that well against clutch, so I'll take it. I'll fucking take it, brother. All right, do we go old path? Uh, well, yeah, of course. Duh. Curse of the Lost. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. What the fuck do you mean, Curse of the Lost? Just after I get Spelunker hat. Insulting. Absolutely insulting. Now I gotta keep a fucking mental map of this place, bro. Fucking hate it. I hate it here. Amnesia. Well, I already have Curse of the Lost, so... That doesn't matter. I, I can't use these pills. I gotta wait until I'm done with the fight. The lack of damage is really starting to hit me. I mean, I got Dark Arts, which can give me damage, but man, I need... Like, I need something. I need some damage ups. I'm starting to feel it. I'm really starting to feel it. Let's start using these pills. X-Lax does nothing. Tears up is huge. Although I think I already had the tears cap anyway, but whatever. Curse room, what do you got for me? Ah, oh, my deal. And it's exactly what I hoped for. Do I take Holy Grail? Do I want flight more or do I want some... I don't need the tier rate, so yeah, I'll take the flight. I got exactly what I needed. I, I get my second key piece out of this, which is amazing. Uh, it allows me to go to my item room and do the, the deal shenanigans from that. You know, it's an interesting realization I made earlier uh, today, because I was just, you know, talking to my dad again, hanging out, uh, as you do talk to your parents, if you have a good relationship with them, at least. I've realized that I'm like, I'm cut from the same fucking cloth as my dad. I mean, you'd expect that, you know, like, he's my dad, but like, I, I'm just like, exactly like him. What, what I mean by this? You know how, like, part of the identity of this channel is that I just talk about random anecdotal shit that goes on in my life? Uh, just, just as I am doing right now, which makes this bit very meta? Well, that's basically what my dad does all the time as well. Like... Whenever I'm downstairs and I just talk, get, get into a conversation with him, he just talks to me about, like, random shit that he saw on YouTube. He's like, oh, I saw, like, a YouTube video the other day, and then he just, like, talks about it. He doesn't show me the video, he doesn't remember how he found it, it was just algorithmically served to him, right? But he just, like, tells me about this YouTube video. And, like, he's always like, oh, you should watch this video sometime. And then I never watched him, and uh, he never inquires again, but, you know, he's like... Yeah, and stuff. Oh my god, I actually do get a restock machine. Holy crap. I think I get to buy both items here, don't I? Do I want to take a mystery deal? Ah, fuck it, why not? Oh boy, okay. I have flight, so I can definitely do this. I'm going for broke here, man. I want to have something like a banger item. I also need to make sure I actually have the HP to grab it. Yes, backstabber is worth it. I just got to go hit this for a while. I think I can pull that off. It shouldn't be too bad. Backstabber is gonna make it quite easy to kill enemies, and Dark Arts can keep me safe. Matter of fact, it did just right there. 
<laughs> yep, okay. Thank you, Dark Arts, for existing. A soul hardened here, perhaps? No, a greed fight. Okay, well, I guess I'll go fuck myself. Yeah, like, my dad is basically the same as me. It was just like, like, he told me, like, earlier he told me about, like, oh, I saw, like, this fucking maths video that was, like, uh, showing up some, like, maths puzzles or whatever, and I tried to solve them, and I, I got, to, like, a different solution than the, the video got or whatever, and I was like, oh, that's cool. That's cool. And then we talked about maths for, like, five minutes. <laughs> soul heart? Uh, that's HP. That, that'll do. That'll do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I just realized I gulped my trinkets, by the way. I, I just realized with Backstabber, I now have, like, the full nothing personnel kit build. <laughs> I, I'm, like, teleports behind you and then fucking backstabs him. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I knew I was gonna get there. Oh, well. Backstabber did a lot for the damage I put on this run, that's for sure. It was not crazy before this. And it still is far from it. But at least it's, like, serviceable now. Oh, that's huge. I had an angel deal? Huh? Oh, because I already teleported in. Right. Right, because I was like, I have 100% devil chances. What the fuck do you mean I got an angel deal? <laughs> it's because I teleported in earlier. Right. Yeah, that's very fair. Uh, I got everything, right? I've been to a shop, been to the item room, been to, like, pretty much everywhere I care to go to. Yeah, fuck it. If I missed a room, I missed a room. This crest of the lost for you. All right, I guess I'll never see my map ever again. God fucking damn it. Why do you like this game? Why do you like it? Let's go up first. More HP. All right. Dude, I finally escaped. I think we've hit critical mass. I'm finally free from free from the shackles. I've gone very long with encountering without encountering a single special room, which leads me to believe I'm definitely on the way to the boss right now. So I'm gonna have to turn around in a second. Yep. <laughs> I knew it. I just had a feeling. Like it's been a long, narrow path, like a straight path with almost no branching off whatsoever. It had to be the way to the boss. That's just how this game goes. I've played enough of this game to understand how the uh, floors tend to generate. Unfortunately, this means I now have to backtrack all the way down here for all my special rooms. Lucky Rock and Shiny Rock. Sure, why not? <laughs> Give me both of them. I hate- I hate Curse of the Lost, man. Surely next floor I'll be able to see my map again, right? Surely. Smile. Oh, there it is. The item room. The promised land, where I can trade away all this HP, but also go crazy with a restock machine. War Babylon is just free stats, why would I not take it? And this is a fucking blind item, so like... Okay. Well, can I restock this? Wow. I mean, I don't really need the piercing, but I do... I wouldn't mind the damage. <sighs> yeah, fuck it. That's worth it. How curious. I will buy this as well. And I shall turn all of this into stats. It only became useful stats, I am in awe. I am officially done with this floor. I am allowed to- I am legally allowed to leave once I do- Well, the last little, last little bit down here, I guess, that I haven't done yet. Okay. Then I am legally allowed to leave. Which is going to be this way, if I remember right. Yep, alright, I remembered. Wow. <laughs> the lack of a map. Man, this game would be so much easier and so much more fun if you had, like, a map that you could look at to, like, reference where, like, things are on the floor and stuff. Man, the game would be so much more fun if I actually had, like, the ability to look at a map like that. God, they should really add that someday. That would be great. My damn jackpot still isn't crazy, by the way, but it is much, much more serviceable than it was before. It's it's way more acceptable. <laughs> like, I'm actually able to kill stuff now at a decent pace. I got another deal. Let's go up, because I'm already trading all my HP away for deals. Regardless, this one is not really worth it, unfortunately. This one is a rather worthless deal. I Did I... Did I pick something up that gives me a Curse of the Lost every floor? What the fuck is going on? Bro, <laughs> why am I getting a Curse of the Lost every floor? What do you mean? What do you mean it's the third floor in a row of Curse of the Lost? What are the odds of that? Without, without me having to look it up, because I don't want to look it up. Some Somebody tell me, what the fuck are the odds of getting three Curses of the Lost in a row? This is absurd. What the fuck do you mean? At least I don't have to min-max this floor. There's a Tinder Rock here. Thank you, Shiny Rock, for showing me that. Although I probably would have seen it anyway. Ah, uh, never mind, I probably wouldn't have. I would have definitely, definitely not seen that. I hope that I am going the way to the boss. It feels like I might be. Alright, I am. Lovely. That simplifies things tremendously for me. I don't have to worry about it at all. We did get a uh, one more deal. Uh, Ouija board is useless to me, and uh, black powder is also useless, so I guess I'm done. Alright, up we go. I, the run is sped up significantly after this point now, huh? Okay. Hmm, let's go for the secret room. Might as well. I can finally see my fucking map. I can't believe it. Can you guys believe it? They added a map to Isaac. You can see your map now in this game. I know, it's crazy. I, I, it's, I don't know what they were thinking by like giving you the ability to see your map. It's it's kind of it's kind of wild. Seems like a seems like a crazy like overpowered thing to have, but like I'm I'm impressed, really. I'm I'm surprised. Range up. Well, you know what? <laughs> my range is still surprisingly low. Normally every run in this game you're 
inundated constantly with range upgrades. I'm surprised I haven't gotten that many this run. The, the game has been very conservative with the range ups for now. I'm very much surprised. I'm gonna fucking dark arts your ass as best I can. Should really do that on the bullets though. Defensively. Especially when little Dumpy isn't up. Although he is up quite a lot right now. <laughs> Just in time for me uh, to, you know, get blocked again. There you are. You stupid piece of shit. This shit ain't nothing to me, you stupid piece of shit. He's dead. Fucking, fucking backstabber got his ass. Let's go, bro. What are my items of choice? Useless. Decent. Whatever. Conjoint piece. Alright, uh, it's... Eh. <laughs> yeah. I've seen better. I say it like that, I have seen better, but... A chest, I can't believe it. It's actually a pretty good item, too. I love KO drops. Amnesia. Oh yeah, I'll take the amnesia pill, of course. I've had so many floors this run. I'm sure I haven't had enough floors this run yet where I couldn't see my map. Alright, what's the secret room got? Maybe at least something. Sure, an Ankh to respawn with in worst case scenario. I love that there's two chests in here. One of them is 2020. <laughs> it took all this time, but we finally got something. A little bit of a banger item, huh? Explosivo also probably helps a little bit with my damage output. The sides get unbelievably huge, but, you know, that's just the nature. I got like two items that scale my tier size, and uh, the sides themselves, I'm pretty sure, also scale your tier size. So yeah, um, they're pretty large. Very large sides, moving at pretty normal speed. There's, there's not much there's not much crazy going on with it, they're just very large for some reason. <laughs> the real test is gonna be how well this does against Mega Satan. I have a feeling it's gonna do pretty damn well. But that's gonna be like the real test to see what the damage output is actually like. Alright, Mega Satan. Let's see. Those Explosivo tiers are gonna start popping like crazy. And we're gonna have a nice old fight here. Ah, that's, that's pretty good, man. That's a pretty good first cycle, I gotta say. That's an acceptable speed for the first cycle. I've gotten hit, might as well use this then. Backstabber is tearing anything that moves a lot uh, completely apart, which I love. It's those Explosivo tiers, man, I'm telling you. Those are actually doing a surprising amount here. We're on to the angels already, damn, okay. Like, yeah, I love how you can see, like, the amount of, like, spinning and massive scythes build up on the enemy. And then it takes, like, a few seconds. Not even, like, it takes, like, a second, maybe, until they blow up. And once they do, you just, like, see that health board disappear. This fight is going surprisingly well. If you had told me at the start of this run, when I was struggling to stay alive on, like, the fucking Gideon fight and shit, that I was gonna be at this point later on, I would have cast some aspersions on it. I would have cast some doubts. I would have been like, are you sure this is gonna be the same run? Uh, it turns out it totally is. No Dumpy's doing great work. Man, everything's just going so fine. He's dead. All right. Well, that was a pretty good run, man. That was a pretty good run. I am not upset at all. That that worked out. I have once again played my worst character to the fullest potential that I could. I, I guess. I hope you've enjoyed yourself as much as I have. And I guess I'll see you again tomorrow. Have a have a good one. Until then, bye bye.